Welcome to Tally Help videos. In this video, you will learn the process of merging two or more companies with different GST registrations in a single company in Tally Prime. Tally Prime Release 3.0 introduces the multiple GST registrations feature that helps you work on a single company, which will take care of the transactional requirements of all your GST registrations. This saves you from maintaining different companies as you used to do in Tally Prime Release 2.1 or earlier. To maintain all your data of companies with different GST registrations in a single company, all you need to do is migrate to Tally Prime Release 3.0, create a new company and import the masters and transactions of your multiple companies. Let us consider that your business has two branches with different GST registrations and you want to merge the companies created for both. First, let us see how to migrate the company. Since your companies belong to an earlier release of Tally Prime, you need to migrate the companies to Tally Prime Release 3.0. You can see the text migration required against the companies. Press enter on the company and migrate. To know more about migration from Tally Prime Release 2.1 or earlier to Tally Prime Release 3.0, you can view our video How to Migrate Company Data to Tally Prime Release 3.0. And you can create a new company in Tally Prime Release 3.0, which you will use as a parent company to merge your companies with different GST registrations. Or you can import the masters and transactions to one of the companies. Once you migrate the companies with different GST registrations, you will need to change the voucher number series of the companies. Post migration to Tally Prime Release 3.0, the companies have a default voucher number series in all voucher types. Having unique voucher number series ensures that the voucher numbers of the transactions of different GST registrations do not conflict, especially when you have automatic or monthly user auto as the method of voucher numbering. For example, let's change the voucher number series for this company. Press Alt plus G. Alter Master. Voucher Types. Select Voucher Type and press Enter. Press F12. And enable Define Multiple Numbering Series for Vouchers and press Ctrl plus A to save the configuration. Now, enable the configuration in the Voucher Type Alteration screen. You need to rename this voucher number series to some other name so that when you merge companies, there will not be any conflict. Press enter and enter the new series name. Say, this is a Karnataka branches GST registration so we can name it KAR so that the vouchers under the series can be easily identified as the ones created for Karnataka registration. Press Ctrl plus A to save the new series name. Press Ctrl plus A to save the voucher type. You need to follow the same procedure for all the voucher types of both the companies to ensure that none of the companies have conflicting voucher series number. Now, you can export the masters of both the companies and then import it to the new company. Let's export masters from this company. Press Alt plus E for export. Masters. Press C to configure. In the Export Configuration screen, apply settings related to export. Under Type of Master, select All Masters. Press Enter to select some other master that you want to export. File format has to be XML, Data Interchange, 
implement other settings as needed. Select export to and press enter. Say you want to export to a folder in your computer. Select local drive and press enter. Under folder path, specify path. Copy the folder path in your computer, paste it here and press enter. You can also select from drive. Press Ctrl plus A to save. Show more to further configure the export if needed. Press Ctrl plus A to save the export configurations. Press E to export. As you can see, the folder in your computer has opened where the file containing the masters is exported. Now, import the masters in the new company you created to merge both the companies. Open the new company. Now, press Alt plus O for import. Masters. In the import master screen, select the file path where the data is located. Specify path by copying the file path and pasting it here. Select the file to import. The masters are imported to the new company. Similarly, open the other company and export its masters and import to the new company so that you have masters of both the companies in the new company. You can export the transactions of both the companies and then import it to the new company. Let's first export transactions from this company. Press Alt plus E for export. Transactions. Press C to configure. In the export configuration screen, apply settings related to export. Under type of voucher entries, all vouchers is selected by default. Make selections for other configuration as needed. Specify the folder path. Select and press Ctrl plus A to save. Press E to export. As you can see, the folder in your computer has opened and the file containing the transactions is exported. Now, let us import the transactions to the new company you created to merge both the companies. Now, press Alt plus O for import. Transactions In the Import Transaction screen, select the file path where the data is located. Specify path by copying the file path and pasting it here. Select the file to import. The transactions are imported to the new company. Similarly, open the other company and export its transactions and import to the new company so that you have transactions of both the companies in the new company. Once you import masters and transactions of both the companies to the new company, you can start enjoying the benefits of the multiple GST registration feature introduced in Tally Prime Release 3.0. You can record transactions for specific GST registrations and view reports for all GST registrations and a specific GST registration as needed. To know more about using the feature, you can watch our video How to Use Multiple GST Registrations feature in Tally Prime. Thank you. To know more about Tally Prime features, visit help.tallysolutions.com. Subscribe to the Tally Solutions channel for the latest videos.